Hello, and welcome back to Resident Evil 6. Let's play Resident Evil 6. We are uh, going to pick up this key now, over here, because uh, we need it to open the gate in the uh, kind of plaza area. And of course, picking up that key card activated the sky. Um, and as you may have seen uh, there, Oh, his head just sort of, like, squished off of his body. That was creepy. Um, when zombies attack you, sometimes you'll get that little bar showing that, uh, like, a little section that's highlighted, and if you manage to press whatever button it is um, in time, you'll do, like, a counterattack, and usually you'll kill them. Which is handy. Uh, I knew she wasn't dead. Maybe she's a drama student and she's just being a good actress. And so now we have the key card. It shows up on the right side of the screen, just floating there nebulously. He's still dead, though. Aha. Uh -huh. Gotcha. You. Oop, you were. You have a knife sticking in you. I will put you out of your misery. Good sir. Ugh, I hate when they just like fling themselves at you. Step on your crotch. That's what I feel like when someone hits me in the crotch too. Whoa. Suicidal zombies. They're just jumping off the roof now. That's a lesson. Drinking kills. Sorry, that was a lame joke. <laughs> I apologize. Ah, sneak attack. Oh, I got a trophy too. How lovely. And that would be for uh, performing a certain number of sneak attacks. I think it's like five or something like that. And, um... Press L1 and it'll show you where we need to go, which is over there. I hear zombies. Where, where are they? There they are. Bam! Let's see if I can c counter him to show that off, even though I'm bad at it. Ah, I did it! Yay! So yeah, if you counter, it'll do that like shing noise, and then uh, you will usually kill them. Good work. All right. So now that we have the uh, the key card, we can open this uh, gate. Seems like it's gonna make noise. Can we like empty our things? <laughs> should have known better. Uh, yeah, y yes, you should have, Leon. You should have known better. But anyway, so I'm not gonna deal with them. I'm just gonna quickly see if there's anything to pick up here. It doesn't look like. Ooh, there's a zombie there. And uh, it doesn't look like there's anything. <laughs> Why am I having the interaction? Oh. Okay. That's why. Yeah, 
floor. Um, it looks like we can just go through. There's nothing to pick up here or anything. So we're just gonna run away. Oh my god. So, okay, I'm gonna kill you because you're a butt and you threw an axe at my head. Please don't throw axes at my head. Uh oh. Take a right up ahead. The music there. says Keep run, running. run and be safe of horrible zombies. So I'm gonna take its advice and sort of just try to I think we just found a right out of here. Past these. Damn it, no keys. So we have to look for the keys. Are, you sure? Are they in the Oop, they must be in there. I gotta... What about the glove compartment? No, nothing. Should we hot wire it? Hold on. Oh, found the keys. Found them. Yay. Start car. Magically just start. It's clear behind us. Back up. You buckled in? Yeah. First. Sort of on like Mr. Toad's wild ride uh, situation here. Campus. Now we just gotta get through town without getting killed. <laughs> when in doubt, just turn your car over. That'll kill the zombie. Shit! Bad language, Leon. Leon, Elena, are you two all right? Hanging in there. But we need another way. It's kind of cool, though, since we just well, went through I that like ordeal. All of our stamina. The sewers, huh? Great. So we destroyed our car in like a minute. So we're gonna go through the sewer, which of course sounds like a fantastic idea. <laughs> Sewers? Come on, let's just get Is to anyone the really a fan of sewers? Bioorganic weapons represent I'm going to tell them everything. Everything we know about the Raccoon City incident. But sir, a lot of people are questioning my desire to reveal the truth. I know where they're coming. It looks like he doesn't have any eyebrows. It might create more problems that looks than creepy. it solves. A lesson I learned well in the military. Bioorganic weapons are a global threat. And we are partly to blame. We have to come clean and start working with the rest of the world if we want to have any chance of fighting this. Whatever you decide, sir, I'm with you. Always valued your friendship, Leon. It's time we take responsibility and end this mess. It's going to be a tough road. Let's get moving. We don't have much time. So, in the got sewer, our out for us. we have our handy Believe little me. headlights, which is nice, because it is rather dark. And there are rats and zombies and things of that nature down here. 
and we found our first crates, so you can just melee them. And they have random items in them usually. I believe really they're random for the most part. You can shoot them, but that would be a waste of ammo. Leon, Helena, we'll be out of contact when you're in there. I'll still be tracking your movements, but be careful. Right, so we've got electrified cables there. Definitely don't want to touch those. There's a rat. So I guess we have to go this way. But, uh, have to be careful of, of zombies here because we can't really see very well. I see that there's one up here. So that guy tried to jump on me. They sometimes do that. coming. So we have to hold <laughs> those buttons, otherwise you get destroyed by train. I'm not exactly sure How are the why... Still running? Exactly. Not there really no sure. The controls. <laughs> Zombie Express. So it just keeps going. Wouldn't it just like crash into a wall? That doesn't make any sense. horror movie screen. Be careful. Well, we are going to investigate the cheesy horror movie screen next time. Uh, so thank you very much for watching. And uh, until next time, beware of cheesy horror movie screams because they might try to get you when you're in the sewer. <laughs> <laughs>